After Singapore, we move more and more to the east. It's time for Korea. The track at Yeongam is characterized by an alternation of slow and fast corners, as well as long straights with severe braking, requiring a combination of tires that ensure maximum grip, both longitudinal and lateral. This is why Pirelli has decided to bring the medium and super soft compound. With its fast corners, the Korean circuit requires great driving precision of the tires, but a high lateral load puts a lot of stress on the tire construction. The long straights cool the tires down, but then they have to provide immediate grip when the driver brakes heavily before going into the corner. In turn three, for example, the cars are subjected to a deceleration of up to 5.2 G while braking, which means that a load of more than 900 kilograms is placed on the front tires due to the transfer of weight. But what happens to a Formula One tire when it undergoes these types of stress? All parts of the tire are subject to continuous deformation that change the area of the footprint and consequently the level of grip available. Pirelli studies all these deformations and develops the profile and the construction of its tires in order to optimize the distribution of both pressures and temperatures under the footprint area. The lateral forces act on the tire on the long and fast bands and mainly stress the external part of the construction. Longitudinal forces are placed primarily on the front tires when braking heavily and on the rear tires while in traction, which means that the tires are pushed to the ground, stressing the inside shoulder. For this reason, it is essential that the teams respect the prescriptions regarding the best use issued by Pirelli before each Grand Prix.